We have something that is invading our grass and they are called army worms. So here in Alabama, I've seen a lot of people posting and commenting on people's, uh, mostly Facebook, a little bit of Instagram. That, yep. That they've been having problems with their grass dying. Can you see how the grass looks slightly dead? Let's see. You see those patches right there of the dead area? Well, this area here, I thought that it was dying because we had our pool tarp on the ground for a few days. So I figured that the tarp just kind of killed off the grass. And if I can find one. Okay, so here's a little one. Oh, there's a big one. Let me see. They are just going to town. Where are they? Do you see it moving? I'm trying to. Yep, you see it? There's a bunch of them. I found out just now, literally when I was walking, that we are also getting invaded by army worms. So what I think I'm gonna do is, I think the best course of action here is to let the chickens out. Yeah. I think, oh my gosh, I see my grass moving everywhere, you guys. It is so bad. I'm glad it's in the grass and not concrete, though, because if I saw, I saw a friend's post and um, she literally had these army worms all over the concrete and you can see them. They were in her pool. Oh my gosh, I didn't even think to look in the pool. Oh, do I even want to know? All right, well... They're not in the pool, so that's good. I've got a ton of leaves, but no army worms. However, the army worms are seriously invading my grass. Oh, gosh. Just thinking about it makes me itchy. I am not a bug person. I don't do bugs well. I get very itchy, almost to a weird, there's a name for it. It's like some sort of psychosis. <laughs> seriously, guys, it's bad. I. I'm not afraid of bugs. Um, like I don't, I don't freak out, freak out with bugs. But lots of them, like lots of the same bugs, really, really grosses me out. Like one fly, it aggravates me, it bothers me. But a bunch of flies makes my skin crawl. <laughs> army worms, one army worm doesn't bother me but when I see all of my grass moving because of these army worms in it that does something to me horrible <laughs> it's making me itchy you guys it's horrible uh, so anyways I'm probably gonna have to yeah I'm gonna bring the chickens out oh no but the new ones we had put our new chicks in with the older chicks from last year and we haven't let them out yet so I don't know if I should be doing this without my husband. I think I'm gonna wait until my husband gets home from work and then I'll have the discussion with him about the army worms, tell him what's been going on. I don't know if he knows anything about it or not um, and see what he thinks about letting the chickens out to do some damage control because one, I can't handle all those bugs. They're not bugs, they're worms. Let's just face it, they're caterpillars. I can't handle all those caterpillars in my yard just thinking that I'm stepping on them and smushing them all is disgusting. Um, but it'll also be a really good treat for the chickens. So good protein, it's good for them, good for us. And I think that would be a great idea. So I'll keep you guys updated and let you see what the chickens do when they're released. So. Until then, we'll come back in a YouTube second. So it is the next day. 
I had a conversation with my husband last night about um, bringing the chicken and he thought it was a great idea. So that's what we are doing this morning. All right, so we're gonna release only the big chickens and let the little ones stay behind. Oh, you forgot Tilly. Tilly and... Come here, girls. Tilly. Come on. Yeah, come on, you. Come on. You two can come. Mm, not you. Come on, Nugget. Come on, Nugget. Come on, girls. Everybody has a Nugget. Let her up. Come on, you. Come on. I don't know her name. <laughs> Funny. That's the only one's name that I do not know. Chicken Little. Oh, right. And then Tilly. And I think that's it. Come on, Tilly. Come on, Tilly. There's really one more. That's good. The thing with this is that these are the hens that lay eggs. I know. So we go find eggs all over. Yeah, we're going to have to go on a scavenger hunt. This is one of the reasons why. Well, I guess it would be two reasons why. First reason why would be because of predators. But I don't think we have a huge issue with predators. Um, and then the second reason why would just because they put eggs everywhere. They tend to stay in the barn. Um because they eat the goat poop and everything else. So I need to get them in the grass, though. That's what we need to do. I need to get them out of the barn and into the grass. Come on, girls. Come on. This is the way that we call our chickens. Usually it works. My husband says that he is the the chicken master. He can call them. He He speaks chicken language. So we'll see if it works. Beep, 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 beep. Come on, girls. Beep, 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 beep. Over here, girls. Oh, you're cheating. Ah, so the chicken master cheats by grabbing some food. Yeah, like... I know, like... They'll come over here later and actually put some over here too because I don't want them going over by the vegetables um okay I have faith in you my humble chicken master <laughs> well they're happy chickens they're happy to be out huh girls we should put one of those roosters up. Can we at least put um, Kiko up? Why? Why? Because he'll follow them and they'll eat all this stuff too. There's another belly to fill. Full of worms. Yeah. No, I'm telling you. If you look in the grass really good. Really? No, they're there. What color are they? They're black. Black, gray. All right, so the chicken master was somewhat correct. He's got a couple of the girls over here. I don't know if they're going after the food that he fed them um, or if they're finding the worms. Now, I was looking in the grass just a few minutes ago and I didn't see any, but it was later on in the afternoon when I really start started seeing a lot of movement and stuff and and the worms so oh yep see she just got one i don't know if you guys caught that or not but she did have a worm get those worms girl call your sisters tell them to come eat the worms with you thank you so much for watching this video and sticking around until the end. Make sure you like and subscribe and we'll see you guys soon. 
Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.